You have like a billion. We're gonna work on gifts today, Christmas gifts. And here are the ones we're gonna like make like these. And these are not baked yet, but anyway, they're just boxes with bows. And I'll show you how to make it. Condition your clay. Make a semi-square with your fingers. It's not going to look like a box at all. You're going to need one of these clay slicers. And then I like to flip it over because the bottom half is going to be a lot flatter than what you just cut was on the top. So this is my little box. And then you're going to have a different color of clay for the ribbon. Oops. The ribbon. This is going to be that. And I like to take a little square cutter, a Kemper cutter, and cut out two squares. And for each little bow like each half we're going to take a square and press opposite corners together Julie. and gently pull up <coughs> see that so you have one like this use anything to poke it down. Use a q-tip or a toothpick. Anyway, take your second one corner to corner. Mine isn't warmed up enough. I let it sit here too long. It's cold so it cracked. But since I'm showing you, I'll just turn it over and put it on like that. Now you're to make these little string things that come down. You take your clay. I rolled it out on a pasta machine, a number four. And so you have this little guy here. You guys can't see what I'm doing. You have this little guy right here. I'm going to cut the ends so that they're opposite pointies. And I'm going to cut that there. Catherine, stop banging, please. This crazy. Anyway, take your time and try and get those further apart. And then you take a little piece of this clay and roll it into a ball. Slightly fat, flatten it and then stick it on the top like that. And when you're all done, then you bake it and uh, that's it. That's all you have to do. You can use any color or anything like that. So take your time and it won't look quite so wacky. It'll look more like this. Mama, when can I do my video?